This is why the radiator hose is collapsing. Welcome back to Tile 5 Water Repairs. Today's topic, I'm going to tell you guys why your radiator hose is collapsed. The first common reason why the radiator hose collapsed is going to be caused by a faulty radiator cap. The purpose of the radiator cap is to raise boiling point. It also allows coolant to expand and when coolant expands, the valves open up and it allows coolant to flow to the uh, coolant reservoir. When the engine is turned off, the engine starts to cool, coolant starts to contract and it flows back into the engine. However, when the radiator cap is faulty, coolant cannot flow back to the engine. When the engine is off and cool, this will create a vacuum. When there's a vacuum in the cooling system, this is going to cause the radiator hose to collapse. The first thing you want to do is visually inspect the radiator cap. First thing first, check for rust. If you see a buildup of rust in the uh, radiator cap, go ahead and replace it. Next, you want to inspect the, uh, the lower sill or gasket. And if it is torn or ripped, go ahead and replace the radiator cap. Next, you want to check the spring. This is going to be the pressure valve spring. If there is no tension when you're pressing the spring in, again, go ahead and replace the radiator cap. And lastly, make sure the radiator cap fits properly on the radiator filler neck. If it doesn't fit properly and it feels kind of loose, again, replace the radiator cap. One more thing, if you see any piece missing on the radiator cap, such as the sill or this tip over here, if it broke off, again, go ahead and replace the radiator cap. If you replace the radiator cap and the radiator hose still collapsed, maybe the radiator hose is just worn out. When the radiator hose becomes worn, the rubber part here becomes extremely soft and also the inside can also start to become thin. When this happens, the uh, radiator hose cannot retain its shape. Again, it can cause it to collapse. In addition to that, some radiator hose, there's a spring on the inside to help retain the shape. When the spring becomes rusted and it starts to fall apart or can even break, again, this can cause the radiator hose to collapse. If you replace the radiator cap and you change the upper and lower radiator hose and the radiator hose is still collapsed, maybe there's a major clog somewhere in the cooling system. When there's a major clog somewhere in the cooling system, such as the radiator and so on, this can definitely cause a suction in the cooling system. For example, let's say you have a clog somewhere on this side of the cooling system. And when this water pump is spinning, and coolant cannot flow because there's a clog somewhere, it's going to cause this radiator hose to collapse as the water pump is spinning. I hope you found this video useful. As always, thank you for watching and subscribe to Top 5 Water Repairs.